And now for a quick look at some of the stories from the world of art and culture. Stay tuned for our News Roundup Shortcuts. Oscar-winning filmmaker Steven Spielberg has urged Harvard University graduates to become heroes in real life. Speaking at commencement on Thursday, he pointed out the importance of empathy in a world full of racism, homophobia and religious hatred. Egypt's Antiquities Minister Khaled al-Anani reopened the pyramid of Pharaoh Unas after 20 years on Thursday. The pyramid contains some of the oldest surviving texts from ancient Egypt dating back to the 5th dynasty of the Old Kingdom. Two tombs were also reopened for the first time since the late 1980s. The Georgia O'Keeffe Museum in Santa Fe, California has acquired a painting by the artist that had been held in private collections since 1946. The museum purchased the Barnes Lake George from Christie's Auction House for $3.3 million. X-Men Apocalypse is expected to grab the top spot at this weekend's North American box office with more than $68 million in ticket sales. But it won't be easy, as Alice is also making a return to the big screen with the sequel, Alice Through the Looking Glass. The remake of Roots, an international phenomenon in the 1970s, is set to premiere on Memorial Day this Monday. Tony Award-winning actress Anika Noni Rose plays Kizzy, the daughter of main character Kunte Kinte. She says the miniseries based on Alex Haley's bestseller comes at the right time in the wake of the Black Lives Matter movement.